Good day. These idiots in Brussels, they might have some problems with Sweden in the future because now they want to raise the fee for Sweden. We are already paying a lot of money to Brussels and now they want to raise it. These motherfuckers, they want to raise it with another 40% because the UK is leaving the EU. And um, well, there might be a problem because the Swedish politicians, they are not very keen on paying more money to Brussels. We have a welfare system in Sweden that is crumbling severely. And the socialist leader, Stefan Löfven, he was asked about this a couple of times. And he said, no, Sweden will not pay more to Brussels. So he is commi <laughs> he is committed to this, yeah, not paying more. I know there is a problem with socialists and commitments. So they will possibly find their ways around this problem and Sweden will have to pay anyway, so. But we'll see. The future looks interesting. I also want to talk about Gerard Batten. He's the new leader of UKIP party in the UK. I listened to him yesterday, I listened to an interview, and I got this good feeling about this guy. Uh, almost the same feeling that I got when I listened to Matteo Salvini, the leader of the La Lega party in Italy. A tough, this is a tough guy. He's not afraid to speak up, so I really like him. If I lived in the UK, I would certainly vote for him. I really like him. So, I was reading about him in The Guardian. <laughs> and they are worried about him. They say that he's uh, trying to move the party towards the hard right. Yeah. In my opinion, there is no right-wing party in UK anymore. No. So this is exactly what's needed. Somebody is moving to the hard right. Yeah. He's urging people to read the Quran so that they can educate themselves about the threats. And uh, he repeated his belief that Islam is inherently anti-Semitic and that the Labour Party is deliberately tolerant of the prejudice in order to attract voters. He says, I draw attention to the problem that the Islamic ideology brings to our country and I think that's a perfectly reasonable thing to do. You see, this guy is not afraid. This is exactly what Britain needs. Yeah, we need a strong UK in Europe, yes, they have tried to put uh, the UK down, they are trying to, and they are doing a good job with it, I think, I'm very sad to see what's going on, I'm almost as sad about the UK as I am with Sweden, to tell you the truth, yeah, because the UK should lead Europe out of this insanity that we have in Europe. So um, I have good hopes and I really like this guy. I hope you support him. Gerard Batten, the new leader of UKIP. Okay, that's it. Bye.